When it comes to finding which keywords to target, there are all types of different complicated, over-explained ways that people suggest trying to find the keywords to target for your business. I'm gonna show you a simpler one. So if you have a small business and you're trying to grow it with a blog or just optimize your website, I'm gonna show you a tool that I use um, and I find it just to be the easiest way to find uh, keywords to target for your blog or for your business. So basically, it's this keyword chef and it's pay as you go. So you're not paying a monthly fee all the time for something you're not using. You just pay for the credits that you need. And basically you go in and you can just plug in um, like a discovery of which keywords you're interested in. So you just type in your topic. And then when you type in your topic, it's gonna generate uh, information for you. So you can see here, I'm just gonna go to the small business section. It's gonna generate a huge list of keywords for you. And then you can really easily filter this list. So the information it gives you is exactly what you need. So it's gonna tell you, okay, small businesses, where to start. That has an average in the last month, a high um, 12 month average of monthly searches of 14,000. It's got a um, high of 18,100, or the average of 14,800, a high of 18,100, and a low of 14,800, right? So it's pretty consistent. And then what it tells you right here in the search is it tells you the number of websites that are like easy uh, sites that are ranking on the first page, right? So ones that it thinks, you know, if you have a decent website and you build this in, you have a good chance of ranking on the first page for this keyword. So basically all you do is just sort it like this. And then it tells you, okay, there are four websites, there are three websites here, there are two websites for each of these that are websites that aren't that really strong of websites for those search results, um, which gives you good indication that you can, you know, outrank those websites potentially. Um, so you can see like here, can a small business use Office 365 Home, right? That has four on the first page, but you can see the average is zero across the board. So nobody really searches for that so you could rank for it but it's not going to lead to really very many clicks so the sweet spot that you want to find is like how many small businesses in the us maybe or do small businesses pay taxes right or if you're maybe starting a local cpa business um, or a cpa practice that could be a good way to get clients um, you can see there okay people do search that hey maybe it's not that competitive on the home page because there's some websites here that are indicated to me are easy easy sites to potentially beat out and it's going to give you the opportunity to go through and look at keywords and just compare these things what's the search volume and then how competitive does the uh, first page look and then if you need more ideas you can just look at similar and then it's going to give you a list of similar keywords or questions that people are asking too so it's a really nice tool. It's an easy way to find more keywords to target for your small business and it's pay as you go. So give it a try and uh, just pay for what you need. Wishing you the best of luck. Hit that subscribe button.